Hello and welcome to No Man's Sky. This is Alan Paul once again. We're going to be doing the Weekend Anomaly mission yet again. Uh, we're going to be taking my sweet ride that I have back here. This is probably going to be my primary ship for a good time. So let's go ahead and jump in my Hunter Interceptor and take it for a spin. And why is this ship my uh, primary one now? Well, because it's got some sweet, sweet, uh, sweet, sweet damage. You know, running at 87,000 damage from this sweet boy because of all the, uh, the potential uh, charges around it that are just, it's just an awesome ship. It's all around an awesome ship. I can't even remember what system I got it at. I've been in so many stinking systems at this point. But let's pull in the anomaly and check things out and see what our mission is for this weekend. Now everybody's going gaga. Remember, 4.2 is out. Actually, it's 4.22 because the patch is out. Please read your patch notes. A lot of things were fixed. Honestly, there were things fixed that I didn't even know was a problem. I just thought it was supposed to be that way. Oh, okay, they changed that. That's pretty much what went through my mind, and then I realized, oh, no, that was a problem. Okay. Well, I guess I should have reported it. I didn't. So here we are. Anyway, so one of the things we can do, by the way, and that I don't have in here right now, is we can add a teleport receiver now, finally. Wouldn't let us add that before, so now I can, you know, get things off my ship when I need to. Might as well do that while I'm here. All right, let's see what the anomaly holds for us at the Nexus. Niche in the stars. We have to construct an outpost. Okay, we're going to get a warp hyper core out of it. 1800 Quicksilver, of course. So let's go ahead and initialize the mission. Start said mission. We are on our way. Come on. Pop up. Come on. There you go. Dee -dee 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 -dee. And we're on our way. So let's see what system it brings it to. Right now my starship, my, pardon me, my freighter, is in a system that had a corrupted sentinel planet on it. So I've been doing a little digging on that planet, looking for ships and looking for multi-tools and everything else. I saw a lot of the ships and multi-tools people have been getting, and I know you may have seen my recent video yesterday regarding that, but I really want to find my own. I really want to for once, rather than trying to steal somebody else's. So, okay. So where are we here? Okay. And it's going to be this planet right in front of us. Okay, let's go ahead and head there. Habitable planet. Habitable uh, let's try that again in real English. Habitable planet. A little more than three seconds, I think. Got plenty of water on this planet. It's kind of a nice looking planet to begin with. Alright, land on the planet's surface to begin construction. Let's uh, take a quick peek around and see if there's anything else other than the communication spots that we see all over the place. I want to cheat a little bit. I want to see if I can find a nice landing pad I can crash on. As you know, the inside of these ships are pretty cool. I've already got my polo bouncing on my dash dashboard there. But these ships are super, super fast. Not seeing much of anything except for a ship that was behind me. I don't know if that was a... I want to check that out real quick, just to make sure I didn't miss something. No, it must have just been a ship flying. Okay, no big deal. I thought we might have passed over a crashed ship. Anywho, let's keep scanning one more time. I want to see if we can find at least maybe a... I keep hitting that wrong button. Nothing, huh? Yeah, I would have found something by now. This looks like a nice little island to land on and start a settlement. Start my own little settlement, if you will. Hmm. How about... Yeah, it looks good. Right here. Great thing about these ships. Stationary hover ability. Yeah, buddy. Of course, I hit the landing and it's got to move ahead 50 feet. I don't know why. But there we go. We are here. So, establish a construction site. One explorer, deploy a base computer. So you can do this with uh, friends. 
join up with people. So we got to get a base computer going. Let's go over here, check out the animals while we're here. We want to make sure we're not going to get attacked by anything. Highly intelligent, but he likes small trees. And short walks by the water on the beach, collecting seashells. All right, here we go. No sight claimed. We are going to claim the said sight. Position not saved during the Nexus mission. Yes, thank you very much. So hopefully we don't glitch out, crash, or anything like that, but we should be all right. All righty, that's done. Now what? Build infrastructure. It wants a biodome. You know what we need for those? We need glass, mostly. I want to make sure that my backpack refiner, we're in our starship. There you go. I believe I have some silicate in there. Let's go ahead and just pull in some glass. We'll get that started, because I think we're going to need that in order to create the biodome. Yeah, we need five glass. Glad I did it. Stop going into the starship, thank you. Three. Oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, fall asleep there. Four. The slow process. Five. Let's stop for a moment and pull the five out. Can't go any higher. We'll create two more just for the time being. Just in case we're needed. So we're going to create a biodome. Uh, that looks good. Remember, you can erase the space when you're done. Next, construct access routes. It needs a door. Yes, sir. We will create a door. Here we go. We'll put a door right. Why can't I put it on this side? What? There we go. We'll put it right here. Um, I don't like you being there. Hijack laser. Gone. Okay. Uh, we need two straight corridors. Okay. We will make two straight corridors. Pure ferrite is what we need for this. Um, let's see. Let's put them over here. One. Two. Okay. And you don't have to make it anything special. It wants another biodome. Are you kidding me? Hmm. Okay, well, let's do it. We gotta put it over there, but we need more. Guess what? We need five glass again. Well, well, well. So now you know you need ten glass to begin with. Uh, let's see. I need more of that wonderful stuff. Okay. Iodomes. I don't know, that movie did come to mind for just a moment. It's going to start mentioning people's names and stuff, but I think that'd be better if I don't. Okay. Let's construct yet a second biodome. Okay. There we go. See our base computers inside of it? I don't care. Honestly, don't care. We can make this pretty. I'm not making it pretty at all. Uh, biofuel reactor. Okay. Yep. Uh, let's go ahead and get you one of those. Let's put you right here next to it. And we got to run power, of course. Okay, good. And it wants six of them. My bad. Not a problem. Uh, so we'll go two, three, four, five, and six. We got to link them together. Don't forget. No, one to two. Everybody hold hands. Okay, now what? Use the echolocator. I know what the echolocator's for. That's not why I'm here. You're annoying me. Uh, yeah. Let's try it again. A livestock unit and an automated feeder. Okay, well, before we do that, I'm going to do something special, and I'm going to try to get these things fueled up a little bit. Um, I believe I've got plenty of carbon on hand, so I'm going to drop some carbon in on all these bad boys. I was not trying to scan the surroundings. Thank you. I'm guessing that at some point it's going to tell me that you have enough power now and you've charged up everything. It looks like it finally got to that point. I'll use that. Why not? Okay. Yes, and last but not least... 
Because I have a funny feeling we're going to need all this juice by the time we're done. All right, we got plenty of juice going. Let's see. And if you look at one of them, it'll tell you how much power is being used. So we're using 100. We have 250 available. So there we go. We don't have any batteries, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and make a livestock unit. That's this unit here. We need two polyfiber and 50 fecium, which I thought we had fecium on ours. No, we don't. Oh, I don't really want to have to do this, but you're going to make me do it, aren't you? Okay. Where are you? Anybody else? Okay. I'm not sure what special key I gave it. Let's get some uh, fecium from these guys. I'm not even sure what kind of storm I'm gonna get gonna get here. Um, oh, it's gonna get hot. Okay, very good. Usually mild. It's supposed to be a temperate planet. Doesn't seem to very temperate to me. Liar. Okay, so everybody's happy with me. Let's get some fecium at them. Now we need some polyfiber. Uh, let me see what's required to make polyfiber. I know I have the recipe. So we need cactus flesh and star bulbs, which I don't have. Guess what I'm going to have to do? I'm going to have to pull in my freighter. Didn't want to do this, but it is what it is. There we go. Let's see. Now, do we have it now? We definitely don't have enough star bulb. Okay, now there's a star bulb on the planet. That we can find. Um, I thought there was some nearby, if I remembered seeing it a moment ago. I'll take a quick peek around. Hey, look, poop. Oh, that's not a lot. Okay, you guys have got to do better than that. Come on. Let's go. Where is it? There should be a lot of it floating around here. I should be wading through the poop. Ah, oh, this is a really, uh... crappy situation I'm finding myself in. I am so sorry. That had to be said. Come on, guys. Alright, try it again. So we need 50 fecium at some point. So we can get these guys to poop a little bit. And I'm going to look for star bulbs real quick. Uh, let's see. So we want to look for that little thing there. Oh, there they are. I knew they were somewhere nearby. And they'll take a little bit to get themselves done. The great thing about one of these hot storms is that your jetpack works longer. And I could use a bunch of star bulbs. So I'm going to go ahead and gather all this up. Apparently, I need a bunch of it anyway, so. Alright, is that all of them? I think that's all of them here. Storm clearing? That's very nice. How much did we get? Uh, 111, so that's barely enough for one. Uh, do we have any more nearby? We got impulse beans. Well, that brings back memories. Uh, impulse... Star Brambles, 300 units away. We'll go after them in just a moment. Let's head back to the base and see how much poop they left me. Really? Boy, these guys must be constipated or something. I don't know. Really? Nobody. Okay. Let's try one more time here. Guess we gotta wait around. Okay. I specifically... Now I need more creature pellets, even though I've already had some. Okay. 
That was a weird noise. Not sure what to make of that one. Come on, guys. We gonna do it or what? Oh, we got a friend over there. Watchful. Okay, we're good. We're good. As long as he's watchful. Just, if you could watch and let me know if these guys poop. I would really appreciate it, buddy. Alright, so you know what you gotta do here. We got a lot to do here. We need a lot more of that stuff. Especially if we want to make the other stuff. Where'd it go? There we go, polyfiber. So we need cactus flesh, which we got plenty of. We need star bulbs at 200. I need 400 star bulbs. Hey, okay. No, I don't want to interact with you. I just want your poop. Yay. Come on, guys. Out of the way. Let's go. Okay. Any more? Any more? Okay. All right. So we're probably going to need a lot more of that as time goes by. Where did I find that star bramble at? We're going to go that way. Our jet pack. Jet pack is going to run out of fuel a little bit quicker. Boink. I don't know if it'll be there when I get back. Okay, here we go. Alright, that was a very small... ...collection. Okay, let's head back to where we were. Hold on a second. Where'd we go? This way? Okay. Okay, here they are. Do they remember leaving any poop on the ground? No, they don't remember leaving any poop. Oh, nope, that is a egg. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. Rather than keeping you in riveted suspense of how we can do this, I'm going to pause my video and I'm going to collect more. So you guys stay put and I'll be right back. Hang on just a moment. And we're back in the saddle. Let's go ahead and make that livestock unit it told us to make. Um, so now we have... Why do we have two polyfiber? I must have them on my ship. That's kind of strange. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and make a livestock unit here. And then the other thing it wants us to make was an automated feeder, which is here. It looks like we have everything we need here, too. Um... Available to build zero. Okay, this may be a problem. Metal plating, amino chamber, and creature pellets. It says it's missing a component. Let's try something real quick. Let's build the... Let's do... Let's do one second. Let's do more of these real quick. Let's do the amino chamber, and let's go ahead and just create those plates, because I'm sure I can make more. Yeah. All right, let's see if we can do it now. Ah, yep, see, that's what it was. Okay, good. And now we have to supply power to them. Uh, where's the power at? It's on the other side, I'm sure, right? Yes, it is. Okay, no big deal. One and two. And we see, there's nothing special. Fill the tank. I guess we'll put some of these in here. And this one. Okay, good. Harvested goods. Next, upload your base. Okay, good. So that's what we're going to do next. Go to our base computer, which is half in, half out of our section here. And we're going to upload it. Base uploading. Mission complete. 
Now, I am not going to leave this monstrosity here for people to find. I am very sorry. There we go. We get our oxygen. We got oxygen out of that. That's really interesting. All right, that should be all the components I've made. And then we'll go over here and as a precaution, we'll do the kind thing and delete the base. There we go. And we're done. And that, my friends, is the mission. So we are going to get back on our ship, go back to the anomaly, and we're going to do our thing. Meteor shower. Oh, that's wonderful. Um, where did we park the car? There it is. Okay. Oh, well, that's not great. Look at that. I have never seen something like that before. Holy mackerel. Now that's a picture, right? <laughs> yeah, buddy. All right. Let's get in our ship and get out of here, shall we? And we should be in space already. Let's just get a little further away, and we call in the anomaly. And don't worry about that system I left. It wasn't really uh, panning out very well. I'll go to a different system. I'll look for more ships and more multi-tools. And I promise if I find something just as spectacular in a ship or multi-tool, I will share it with everybody. It's what we do. It's part of the community, right? All right. So it looks like this is the end of our episode, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. And... Let's go ahead and collect our reward, shall we? And there we are. Complete mission. Ta-da! 1,800 more Quicksilver. Now, my understanding is that other item, uh, Tier 2, has opened in the Quicksilver Synthesis Companion. Yep, there it is. Well, it looks like we got all three. The third one opened, too. Well, what a great thing that is. So there's our ship and pilot sign. And now the black hole... In the wall sign. I can't wait to put that on a new sky base if I can get around to doing one of those. Awesomeness. Okay, we we're good. So all two, three tiers have been complete. We don't have a new tier that's showing up yet. So I think if we go to our log, let me see here. Community research. Just says it's complete and that something else is going to pop in here sooner or later. We just don't know what it is. So we'll wait for Hello Games to figure that out. All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. I hope, really, that you're enjoying the new updates. Um, I frankly think... I've, I haven't been this excited on an update in a very, very long time for these wonderfully cool ships. Uh, I'm really, really enjoying everything about them. Um, it's been really exciting. So, hey, hit that like, you know, that thumbs up button at the bottom. Really appreciate it. And if you like what you've heard, please hit the subscribe button. Thank you very much. We'll see you all in another video. Take care, everybody.